Hello everybody. Today we're going to be learning Fast Fingers number one for alto sax. As you can see, our first group here is A to B. We know that this first one is A because we use our spacing, F to A. We know this one's a B because we use our line saying every good band. Okay, that movement is going to be our second finger coming up as we go from A to B, just like that. Say it with me. A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B. Excellent. Let's play that together. And as you start each note, remember to touch your tongue to the reed uh, so that we can get a nice clean sound like this. Okay, let's play. One, two, three. Ready? Go. Okay, let's do that again. A to B, moving that second finger, touching our tongue to the reed to get that nice tonguing sound. Two, two. Awesome. Now we'll get our next group ready and I will be back with you. And we're back. Now we're looking at our second group, which as you can see is B to C sharp. We know this is our B because it's on a line and we use our line saying every good band. This one we know is C sharp because it has the hashtag symbol, which in music is sharp, and it's on the space, F, A, C. C sharp is a different note than C natural, so we're going to use a different fingering for it. Our C sharp is actually open. So when we go B to C sharp, we're gonna take our first finger off like that. Okay, let's say it as we do it. B, C sharp, B, C sharp, B, C sharp, B, C sharp. Let's play it. Let's do it again. One, two, set, go. Okay, I'm going to get the next group ready and I will be back with you. And we're back. As you can see, our next group is C sharp to D. You probably noticed by now that the um, last note of the group is the first group of the next group. So we're starting with our C sharp, which we know is C sharp because it has the sharp sign that looks like a hashtag, F A C with the sharp. You know this one is D because every good band deserves. Okay, so C sharp to D is gonna require us to go from no fingers to all of the fingers, including the thumb on the octave key in the back. So let's practice that fingering change. C with nothing, D to all of the fingers except the pinkies. C sharp to D. No fingers to everything but pinkies. No fingers to everything but pinky. C sharp, D. Okay, let's try playing that. One, two, ready, go. Okay, let's do that again. C sharp to D. Um, nothing to everything but pinkies. One, two, ready, go. Okay, now I'll get the next group ready and I'll be back with you in a second. All right, now we're here with our last group. We have a D to E, as you can see here. You know this is a line because every good band deserves. 
And we know that this one is the E because it's on a space and F A C E as we use our saying from bottom to top. So remember that our D is everything except for pinkies, including that register key on the back right there. Now, when we go from D to E, we're going to be moving our ring finger up and down like this. Let's say it, D, E, D, E, D, E, D, E. Okay, let's try playing it. One, two, ready, go. <laughs> Okay, let's do that again. D to E. Just moving that ring finger on our right hand. One, two, ready, go. Okay, now let's review all of them. Our first group on this one was A to B. Yep. A to B, so we're going with our uh, middle finger moving up and down. Let's play that, A to B, one, two, ready, go. Then our B to C sharp, where we have first finger um, by itself on the B to C sharp open. B, C sharp, B. C sharp. Let's play that. One, two, ready, go. So as you play that one, you'll really be wanting to use that um, thumb resting place on the back if you're not using it enough. When you lift your fingers off of this, your saxophone's gonna shift a lot. So make sure you're really using that right thumb to support. Here's B to C sharp again. One, two, ready, go. Okay, our next one is C sharp to D. This is one of the biggest movements we have where we go from open to everything except pinkies. Open to everything except pinkies. Open everything except pinkies. C sharp to D. One, two, ready, go. Okay, let's do that one again. C sharp to D. One, two, ready, go. Good, and now our last group is the one that is still up here, our D to E, where we're going to be moving our ring finger on our right hand with our register key on, because whenever we are D or above, we're going to be using that register key. Okay, let's do that again. One, two, ready, go. Okay, let's do them all on a row. A to B first. One, two, ready, go. B to C sharp. Here we go. One, two, sharp, go. C sharp to D. One, two, set, go. D to E, one, two, ready, go. Congratulations, you've just learned fast fingers number one for alphabet.
alto saxophone. If you have any questions, please be sure to let me know, and I will see you in the next lesson. Bye.